It's hard to believe we're in a whole different country. Although it feels just like home. Hmm? Well, this part of Ajul is hardly what I'd call exotic. Huh. Hey, there's a map. Let me check it out for a bit. Brave kid. The way he plays it cool. Decided to make the best of it, has he? He's not as immature as he looks. Would it kill you to show a little concern? I mean, you dragged him into this, right? He insisted on helping me. I told him again and again to go home, but he wouldn't listen. He's here of his own accord. <laughs> I see. He believes he got himself into this mess, so now he has to put on a brave face. Either way, he's still acting like an adult. North of here. Hmm. So? You leaving now? No. Alvin, you must be well versed with the sword. Mercenaries like you must have some battle chops. Well, yeah, of course. Could you teach me how to use one? I don't have the four to back me up anymore. If I can't wield a sword, what's left? The four? Not sure I follow. But I'd be more than happy to teach you. If only you had some cash. So you won't help? Here, how about we make some moolah while I train you? What do you mean? Well... There's got to be some paying customers here in the Sea Haven, right? Let's take a look around. This was surging with mana when they activated their so-called Lance of Kresnik. So this must be the key they used to arm it. Do you want something? Whoa, hold your fire. I come in peace. Can't a mercenary have a friendly chat with his clients? That much is fine. But when you want to chat, you needn't hold your breath and sneak up behind me. Sheesh. <laughs> you make me sound so unsavory. Do you berate poor Jude like this too? I don't intend to berate anyone. That was never my intention. Do try to be gentle with him. Boys can be so vulnerable. That's a surprisingly tender sentiment. That's what it says in my business card. The mercenary with a heart of gold. Those are good words to live by. Although, with a motto like that, I can't imagine you'd live very long. <laughs> Not the type to sugarcoat things, are you? Hey there. You've got a request, right? How about letting us handle it? Oh, you're mercenaries. Oh, perfect timing. What kind of request? Someone's got a problem with monsters, and we get paid to solve their problem. Oh, so by taking on these jobs, you get the reward, and I get the practice. Right, everybody wins, well, except the monsters. Okay, hit us with the details. Some monsters we've never seen before are lurking near a lake west of the Sea Haven. A lot of people depend on that lake for water, so those monsters have become a real nuisance. I'm looking for someone to exterminate the beasts. What's the reward? Cash, of course. You heard the woman. Thoughts? Sounds fine to me. Fighting monsters will be good training. Excellent. Now these beasts are no pushovers, so please watch yourselves. About your sword training, the monsters aren't just going to stand there like training dummies, you know? We should go over some basics first. I appreciate it.
Ready your sword. Well, that'll do. You have my gratitude. Shall we go? Wait, Jude. Take a moment to consider your situation. You don't have to stay with me anymore, you know. Uh, right. Now that we've crossed the border, it'll be a while before any pursuers from Rashugal get here. What are you suggesting? Just that he still has some time to think things over. Sorry, I'll make up my mind by the time you set off. Okay, very well. Let's go and complete that request. You thought you were doing the right thing. Now you're on the run. That's a pretty tough lesson for a kid your age. Yeah, but I brought it upon myself. So these ships have spirits channeled into their sails to intensify the winds they catch. What a clever idea. Human spirit arts can be very impressive. Let's see. What are you up to? Just trying to organize all of my notes for my thesis. Those in the books at a time like this? You sure are studious. Yeah, probably a waste of time. I'm sure I've already been expelled being an X-marked criminal and all. Ah, cheer up, kid. If I get a chance, I'll testify to the military and the school on your behalf. Shouldn't be hard to make the case that you're just a poor kid who got sucked into this. Thanks. But... Aren't you a wanted criminal, too? Ah, that. I guess I did flee along with you. So if we get captured, I'll testify for you. I'll tell them that you're nowhere near as shady as you look. <laughs> I'll take it as a compliment. <laughs> 